Xi Yuch, Spoiler from Wednesday, July 20, revealed that China is currently suffering from a serious psychological crisis. She worries about her own future. In fact, none of us do not feel fear when we are about to lose our freedom. Meanwhile, Spencer Cassidy and Esme are quietly confronting each other. Esme is furious when Spencer repeatedly asks her to drop the charges against Gina Robinson so that she can return to her normal life. Cody Bell's work as a stable. Cody develops feelings for Reed Westburn. He doesn't even care about his blackmail plot. Dante Falconeri knows that Cody is having a hard time. Maybe he's partnering with someone. However, this relationship is forced. Dante hopes can awaken Cody, but he ignored Dante's warning. Meanwhile, Reed Westburn goes to see Brad Cooper, and she tells him that she and Cody are on their first date. In fact, Brad also knows that this isn't a real date, rather it's just a poll, a poll of the other size. Although they both have feelings for each other, the barrier of hatred separates them from true love. Willow Tay and Michael Carinto go to the hospital for routine prenatal checkups. Willow had a private meeting with TJ's expert after the blood test results were released. Everyone, including Willow, was overjoyed to hear she was pregnant. But the happiness didn't last long. Willow is a hind rig uh, facing a devastating disease that threatened the lives of both her and her unborn baby. After TJ's received Willow's blood test report, the results show that the number of white blood cells in the blood was too high for the red blood cell. TJ's made the diagnosis that Willow likely had leukemia. This makes it difficult for her to keep the pregnancy in her belly, even her life. Immediately after that, TJ spoke to reassure Willow he did not want her to suffer too much psychological shock. So TJ asked Willow to do a few more blood tests. Jocelyn Jacks is a stubborn person. However, she is a good friend of Gina. She has her own way. Jocelyn wants to stand in court and claim that she knows who shot and released the video of her and Cameron Webber which is sure to come as a huge shock. Jocelyn and everyone knew that Esme was the one who did this. She blames Gina, but none of them have proof. Currently, Gina only has Spencer left at the best alibi. However, she cannot use him as a tool to rescue to herself, to rescue herself.